With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. So question says the rate low for the reacting below is given by this expression, right? K into concentration of A and concentration of B, right? And the reaction is A plus B giving the product B, right? So if the concentration of B is increased from the 0.1 to 0.3 more, right? Keeping the value of A at 0.1 more, right? So the rate of rate constant will be right. So we have to tell the value of rate constant, right? So we have given the reaction and reaction is like this A plus B, right? So A plus B is giving the product P, right? So A plus B is giving the product P, right? So for this, the rate low, the for this, the rate low becomes, right? So for this, the rate low becomes, right? So it becomes K into, so I, if I write here, is equals to K into concentration of A, right? And concentration of B, right? So this is the rate low for this reaction, right? So it is said in the question that if the concentration of B, right? So if the concentration of B is increased from 0.1 mole to 0.3 mole, right? And keeping the value of concentration A is constant, right? So or you can say that it is 0.1 mole, right? So we have to tell the value of rate constant, right? So we know that the rate of reaction is totally dependent on the concentration, right? So from here, I can say that the rate of reaction is totally dependent on the concentration of A, right? And rate of reaction depend upon the concentration of B, right? So from here, I can say that the rate of rate constant, right? Rate constant does not depend upon the concentration of A and B, right? So I can here right here so the rate constant k it does not depend on the concentration of b right so i can say that it does not depend rate constant k the k does not depend on so right i can write here that the k does not depend on does not depend right right so i can here write clearly does not depend on concentration of A and concentration of B, right? So, the, this K is rate constant, right? So, it is only and only dependent upon the temperature, right? So, according to the Arrhenius equation, Arrhenius equation says that, I am writing the Arrhenius equation, Arrhenius equation says that the rate constant K is equals to, right? The Arrhenius equation K is equals to, A is the Arrhenius parameter, right? Pre-exponential factor E exponential minus E A. This is our acquisition energy, right? So, divide by RT, right? So, I can say that the rate constant is totally and totally depend upon the temperature and now you can say the effect of catalyst, right? So, we know that K is also dependent on the acquisition energy and acquisition energy depend upon the addition of the catalyst, right? Or removal of the catalyst, right? So, I can here say that clearly that the value of K or you can say that the value of the rate constant does not depend upon the, in the concentration, right? So, from here I can say that the Whatever will be the concentration, the value of the K will be the same, right? So, it will be equals to K, right? So, it will be equals to K, right? So, because we are keeping the temperature constant, we are not changing the temperature, right? So, it means that the value of K will not change, right? Just by uh, changing the concentration of the reactant molecule, we cannot say that the, uh, the rate constant value also changes, right? So, in this way, we can say that the value of rate constant will be only and K, right? So, it will be, it will always become K, right? So, in this option here you can see the option and oh, by just seeing this explanation i can just select or you can say that just select the option right so here option a says that it is equal to 9k no it is it's not equal to 9k right so it option a becomes automatically wrong and because it is totally independent upon the concentration so k by 3 is not, not possible right and it yes it is equals to k right so k will be the same value right so it is only equal to the k right so, it is not three times, right? So, D option also wrong, right? So, we are left only with the option C, which is equals to the rate constant K, right? So, in this way, we can say that the value of K or rate constant does not change on when we change the concentration of the reactant molecule, reactant side, right? So, it does, it totally depends on the temperature and the catalyst, right? So, we are only left with the answer C, that is the correct answer, right? So, hope this answered your question. So, thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.